Good morning, wherever you are in the world. It might be good afternoon, it might be good evening. And uh, great opening quote by Justin Benton. Check it out. In three words, I can sum up everything I've learned about life. It goes on. Robert Frost. Anybody know who Robert Frost was? Well, I'll tell you, he was a poet. He was America's Poet Laureate. I wonder who the uh, current Poet Laureate is. I'm not really sure, but poetry hasn't really taken a huge spot in our literary circles since, quote, the old days. Um, I read Edgar Allan Poe. I read Walt Whitman. I read Ralph Waldo Emerson. I read people that can put words together that are inspirational. Some are a little harder than others to read. Henry Wadsworth Longfellow, for example, you have to kind of get it. And it was written in old world English at the time. They always try to add nuance in their time. And that's the hardest part to understand. But this morning is about impact and what impact you're making on yourself and then ultimately on others. What's the, your impact factor? Whoa. Impact factor. Do you have one? Is it good enough for you to uh, get a response, get posted about, get thanked on Facebook or thanked on some social platform in video? And if you notice, I used my high school grammar. We had another high school quasi zoom reunion yesterday our third one in as many months totally cool you know 50 or 60 people online talking about bullshit and retirement and i'm i'm not in i'm not in the bullshit category i'm not in the retirement category so i try to add humor and i know all these people because i went to school with them and the only reason they're there is because we went to school together now they do make impact because they've had successful careers. They've done a lot of things. We have actresses. We have news anchors. We have authors. We have successful entrepreneurs. We have amazing people in the group. And, of course, not everybody goes. But the bottom line is I go because I want to see what's going on. It's an hour. And it's an hour with people that you're – that's the sociological um, – I don't know, weird thing that the only reason we're there is because we went to the same school. Some have remained friends. I have friends that, you know, I talk to all the time from the from the school, but answer not not many. Um, but still some and some are really, really good friends. And the challenge that you have, um, if you're watching, Ken Artis, um, if if you uh, have real good friends, the key is to stay in touch with them. And this is a great way to try to do it. I mean, it's just an amazing way. So just before Justin, Eddie popped on, I just want to make sure that Eddie with his American flying flag is on there from Fort Worth, Texas, where they actually have good barbecue. And then Justin went from first on YouTube to first on Facebook. And then Cynthia, and then Rudolfe, and then Jim dude. And then Kuna from far, far away in Singapore. And then Philly shows up. Good morning, Anthony. And then Brian shows up. So what's the impact? There isn't one person. There is not one. Oh, wow. The great Mike Brooks is here. Good morning. How are you? Um, there isn't one person in this live today that can't make an impact for themselves first, always, and then for someone else or with someone else or then to someone else. But if you notice, uh, and the reason I brought my high school in, um, what impact will you make today and with whom, not with who? Whom is the old correct version grammarly. And we took a grammar test in high school every day for four years. You're not going to fool me in grammar. I'm not going to get it wrong. I know damn near every rule of grammar. And 
I actually take pride in it. Because boy, when I'm telling you, when someone, when I say, hey, thanks, and they say, you're welcome, and they spell it Y-O-U-R, I delete them mentally forever. Think about your grammar and think about what an impact that makes all by itself. People are judging you by your words and by your deeds. And if your words don't make sense, then your deeds probably won't either. Make certain that whatever you're writing, that it reads well to the recipient, that it reads safely, correctly to the recipient, succinctly to the recipient. It's, I, I'm, I'm writing right now. I'm writing my, my next book called Go Live. It'll be my 17th book. Wow. Wow. I'm taking on a couple of other people to write chapters. Um, I think it's important that I take outside viewpoints in this book, especially because there are other people out there, Tara Counterman and Ken Walls especially, who will be contributing their expertise about podcast and about going live, about live streaming, because that's the future. Do you have a podcast? That's my question. If you have a podcast, put it in the notes. If you don't have a podcast but want one, put it in the notes. And and then put yourself in a position where um, you can broadcast to the world. I mean, you can be more popular than the New York Times, which has fallen on popularity challenges. But if your audience is right, you, you, the world is there for you. All you have to do is hit the send button, hit the live button, hit the go button. Just go. Well, I'm not very good at it. Well, then fucking do it until you get good at it. Seriously? Seriously? Well, I'm not very good at it. That is an opportunity statement, not a not not a lament. Anyway, I think you're in a position where you have to begin to do something for yourself right now. Get out there and tell me what you're going to do that's going to make an impact. Where's your podcast? Where's your live broadcast? Where's your live stream? I'm doing it every day. I'm, I'm probably close to 100 days. I haven't measured it yet, but it's a lot. And then what we do, my my virtual team and my and U.S. team, we take the video, take out all of the salient points, put it all together, and then push it out in another platform. Oh, it's called repurposing. And if you can repurpose on Twitter, you can repurpose on LinkedIn, you can repurpose on YouTube, you have another exposure to thousands and thousands of people or not. Or you can watch TV and drink a beer like a fool. Up to you. Now is the time. Now is the time. If you take advantage of it, you win. If you don't take advantage of it, you're vulnerable to someone else who does. I'm not going to say you lose. I'm just saying you're in second place. Is that really where you want to be? <clears throat> Is it? Huh? No. No, it's not. So I'm challenging you. Look at Kuna's nice message. Come on, look at this. <laughs> Love and respect. Love that. Rodolfe, nice message. Good morning, emerging winners. I just love that kind of stuff. I just love that kind of stuff. Joe Williams, all days are the same. Great. And your job is to make sure that they're great for you. That's exactly correct. Rules are in every company for everyone to follow, uh, except salespeople. <laughs> All right, Chuck, Kansas, Eddie, good morning. And Toru is here. You know, Toru, it's a pleasure to see you. Well, it's, I don't actually see you, but um, in the coming weeks, I'm gonna start to bring people on live so they can give their best sales tip. So get ready, everybody. If you have a great sales tip, and uh, I'm not gonna ask for it right now, but I want you to make a video of it and then send it to me on a hippo video. Jeffrey at Gittimer.com. Send me your best sales tip. 
and I will take a look at them, make sure you're cool with them, and rock and roll. I got to, okay. I just remember something that I did not write down, and I got to do it. So see if I can put it here. This, do you text yourself? Huh? Do you text yourself? I don't know. You tell me. I, this is my, my own personal thing. I do it all the time. Evaluate the hippo videos. Okay. Contest winners. Fargo. Uh, what's wrong with Fargo? What the hell's wrong with Fargo? Good morning from Cypress, Texas. Good morning to you, young lady. Carrie, good morning to you from Prairieville, Louisiana. Oh, my God. And Walls, good morning to you, sir. And Facebook user, go to StreamYard.com and let them use your name. StreamYard.com slash Facebook and say, hey, this is Anthea from the western edge of the world. Can you please show my picture? I give you permission. And then we will be able to see someone all the way from, I guess, Perth. I'm not really sure what the city might be, but Bruce Mills, good morning. Martin, good morning. Henderson, good morning. Never put the key in your happiness in somebody else's pocket. <laughs> the key to your happiness in somebody else's pocket. Dude, classic. Dylan, good morning from Orlando. Good morning to you, sir. Chris, Silicon Valley. Whoa, what's happening out there, bud? What is happening out there? Just saw this big announcement from Apple about their next iPhone. It's got all kinds of shit going on. And yes, uh, I'll, Jen will have one in two seconds. I'll probably have one a couple of weeks later. Good morning from Calgary. Good morning to you, Paul. Utah, stay positive. Ready to help others with sincerity starting at home, Jim. See, that's that, now you're talking, dude. <clears throat> Have a dynamite day, Wyatt. What are you doing today? That's what I want to know. Come on, cough it up. What are you doing? Good morning. <laughs> See, this is so cool. This is so cool. Adam, greetings from Singapore. Everyone is watching this awesome live and learning from the best of the best. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. All right. The key is making the impact. Can you make it? I don't know. Impacting me by reading, reflecting, and mentoring. That is the best. That's the best place. That, can you see my box is kind of sliding? <laughs> crazy. Totally crazy. The art of giving is a beautiful thing. I concur. Good morning, Doug Wing. Well, there you go. See, I, I love this. Good morning, Tony. Everyone changes their picture up. Hazel, good morning. If people are asking you to share your message, you're making an impact. Make what you do and say worth sharing. So here's, okay, great. Thank you. You're exactly correct. So people listening, diehards listening, can you please share this? Can you please just send it to somebody else in your troop and maybe they'll join tomorrow morning? Just share it. Wall shares all the time. Hazel shares all the time. Share. Come on, share them. It's not a hard thing to do. You just hit a button. Good morning. And all who come together daily for more JG inspiration. And Tim, unsolicited referrals. Woo, got two of them yesterday. What could be better than that? Well, three, but still two. Amazing. Halifax, Nova Scotia. Thorpe, good morning, bud. Good morning, all these amazing folks. David, Phil. Something to say, Doug Wing, I have a little giant ladder that's impacted me and others in getting shit down at all heights. <laughs> I have hung hundreds of things using my little giant ladder, hundreds. My, we live in old lofts and the ceilings are very high. My contractor ditched his own ladders and, and got little, little giant ladders. Isn't that crazy or what? Right on, Pat. Give value in words and deeds. I agree. I'm a salesman. Everything turned to a virtual now. Share us the best morning routine for all salespeople, 5 a.m. to 10 a.m. Gokul from India. Wake up. 
be happy. Maybe have a little CBD oil in your coffee for Justin. I read, I write, I prepare, and that causes me to think and create. I do those five things every day. Then I post something. Like this morning, <clears throat> I post I post this video up on Facebook every day. It'll have 2,000 views by the end of the day. Depending on the video, four or 5,000 views by the end of the week. Tons of interactions. And I've been consistently doing that. LinkedIn still won't let me post videos on LinkedIn, but the bottom line is I'm trying. This will be my fourth application. I have 29,000 LinkedIn connections, and they won't say yes to me. I don't ask me. I don't know. If any of you know somebody at LinkedIn that can help me have permission to go StreamYard with my LinkedIn connections, that would be the greatest. That would be, if, if you know anybody that knows anybody, just put in the chat. I'll be eternally grateful. You'll actually get an autographed book, two books if they say yes. How about that? Bob, good morning from Florida. JR, what the hell is going? Don't wait for extraordinary seas coming. Occasion to make them great. Weak men wait for opportunities. Strong men make them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Fellow Impact from Calgary. Good morning. Then versus then. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Grandpa knows grammar. <laughs> Oh, my God. All right. William. Go and see, see that this is such a beautiful message. Come on. All things being equal. Yeah. All things being equal, people want to do business with their friends. All things being not quite so equal, people still want to do business with their friends. Love to learn how to write a book. Jeffrey, you are absolutely correct. And thank you, Paul. And Rudolfe, I want to make a podcast. Cool. Brought the podcast microphone. Just need to start. Plug it the fuck in and turn it on. That's first things first. Interview yourself for 20 minutes and then post it. Boom. Greetings from Peachtree. Oh, my God. David. Shout out to Sean for all his help. Cool. I need a podcast and a YouTube channel. All you have to do is go online and make them. They're free. Jeffrey, good morning. My podcast is called Video Marketing and Mayhem. Cool. This is it, the quad show. That's it. No, the quad show. Quanda show. Bob, good morning. And where does the Quanda show emanate from? Gittimerize me, please. Okay, cool. Hi, Jeffrey Gittimer. You are the best. Go, go, go. Charleston, where are you from? Nice mask. Charleston, where are you from? Oh, Charleston. Charleston, where are you from? Justin, you had the original Grammarly app at your school, Jeffrey, with four years of grammar tests. And what did you do with it? Writing book number 17, that's true. It's our high school class, it was it was like a, a literally a, a page um, out of Catcher in the Rye, if you've ever read Catcher in the Rye. I identified with Holden Caulfield for years. Um, they're standing in front of the office and we were on our 50th reunion standing in front of the office and somebody said, what was the best thing we got out of high school? And every single person agreed it was grammar. Every single person agreed it was grammar. I was just asked to do a podcast on creativity and interview creatives. I hope you will join to discuss creativity and sales. Count me in. Just text me. I'll be there whatever time you tell me, as long as it's not 9.59 a.m. I don't have a podcast, but I don't have a voice at this time. I'm going to be taking Ken Walls' classes. That's excellent. That is an excellent idea. Good morning from the Queen City. Oh my gosh. Well, that's totally cool. 
Radio Repair Bench. I love that. Can't wait to read Go Live book and launch my podcast with video. Would that be a vodcast? No, it would be a podcast because most people listen to podcasts with a video. Jen and I do video all the time, but they're rarely seen because most people listen on their phones when they're going from place to place. Way to go, Tim. I agree. Way to go, Tim. Greetings, Toru. <laughs> that cool or what? Good one. How you doing, bud? One of my supporters ended his email with you regards. I wrote him back. <laughs> what does the F? <laughs> what the F does you regards me? Okay, so and what did he say? Yeah. Purpose and passion are worthy repurposing every time. Agree. Good morning, Agnes. How you doing, Annie? How's it going over there, Puerto Rico? Toru, good evening. Thank you. See, look, come on. People are talking to each other. This is wonderful. <sighs> Toru never sleeps. Benton, I'm ready to go live. Sales tip incoming. <laughs> Eric, good morning, Bob. Good morning, Eric. Good guy. Just a good family guy, pizza guy, family guy, smart guy. Be the man, to be the man, you gotta beat the man. That is exactly, you know, I, uh, I'm i a wrestling fan. I'm a, I'm a former pro wrestling fan. I don't watch it anymore, but I used to watch the hell out of it. Oh, by the way, my shirt, you should see this. It's very important. It's a picture of Benjamin Franklin and it says thoughtful, concerned, revolutionary. And revolutionary has come to mean a bunch of wild things these days, but what it meant in Franklin's time was being on the cutting edge and doing things that no one else was doing, daring to be different, daring to be better and peacefully. I'm just saying. But Ric Flair, Arguably one of the best sports quotes of all time. If you want to be the man, you got to beat the man. And uh, he lived in Charlotte for a long, long time. And I'd see him in the airport all the time. And his, uh, his kid, anyway. But people come up to him and say, hey, champ, can I have your autograph for my son? Meanwhile, they wanted it for themselves. They just didn't want to say it. Anyhow, Mike, emailed myself twice last night. Perfect. I put notes on my calendar and reminder alarm. Perfect. Good morning, Jeffrey and everyone. Come to Portugal. It's nice and warm and the wine is good. I'll bet it is, John. Thank you for the invitation. Maybe Jen and I will take a train when we come to Paris. I'd like to, I have not been to Portugal in 50 years. Yikes. Good morning, Jeffrey and fellow ESW from the road today. Perfect. Got to love that confidence, Ron. I agree. Nothing is the matter with Fargo unless you see red coming from a wood chipper. Oh, my God. Oh. Toru is a samurai warrior. I love this. Good morning to you, Mark. Good morning from Irving, Texas. My impact was being inducted in this morning as president of the Irving Sunrise Rotary Club, service above self. We built for time, we're built for times like these. I agree. I gave speeches at all kinds of, of uh, civic organizations when I first started speaking. I spoke for free. It worked. Built my whole speaking business, speaking for nothing. Good morning from New York City. Good morning, sir. How's it going in New York? You're repainting Fifth Avenue yet again. Good morning from Huntington Beach, California. Christine, good morning from Boulder, Colorado. How's it going there? I text myself to remember to use the bathroom. Can't afford a senior moment. I gotcha. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Yes to Perth, where your column has been published every week in Australian business news for decades. That's so cool. Come on. That's so damn cool. 
What kind of coffee do you like? I drink Death Wish coffee in K cups. I add a little bit of CBD oil in the caffeine flavor, the coffee flavor from Justin Benton, who's on this thing. If you want some, just message him. And um, but Death Wish Coffee has been a sponsor of Sell or Die since its inception. It is the best coffee on the planet. Period. Deathwishcoffee.com. And um, if you go there, just tell them I sent you. Please, to, and just buy. You can buy K Cup. We have them on subscription. They just keep coming. Michael Brown, CEO, friend of mine, great guy, great company, and killing it. I'm so happy for them. I'm so proud of them. Love Callan's Coffee Talk with Rodolfo. Immensely pleasant and insightful guy. Cool. Rodolfo and I are going to be hanging in France. I can't wait. Right now, I can't even get to France. But when I get there, boom, I'm in with Rodolfo. And there's an, another guy from, from Paris. I'll be meeting with him as well. Wes Wyatt, rock star. I agree. Good morning from Tallahassee. Good morning, Christopher. Woods Coffee from Bellingham, Washington. Okay. Washington's full of coffee and Oregon is full of coffee. They have all kinds of coffee places. It's like what you do. You drive through a coffee place and you get a little coffee and you keep going. Justin, wellness coffee equals death wish plus boost CBD oil. <laughs> I love it. Way to go, kid. Shared it out, Ken. Thank you very kindly. Come on, you guys. Hit the share button. Come on. Hit it. Today is a great day. I concur. Pat Hazel, your quotes are going into our company newsletter. Hey, you're talking. Give more than you receive. Great Britain has checked in. Tony Thorpe shared. Doug Twyman. Good morning from the New Jersey Turnpike. <laughs> oh, my God. Myers, good morning. Francine shared. Thank you. Curiosity should be a verb. Doing, solving, experimenting, and accomplishing. Mark, you are absolutely correct. See how my machine keeps sliding here? Crazy. Yeah. Thank you, Joe. I love the help. Exactly. How do you sell books? Write a good one. The process of writing a book on the on the pirate attack. Wow. Wow. Um, <laughs> you you maybe it's the 21st century Captain Hook. I don't you know. Messy. Email me Jeffrey at and put book in the in the. Um, Subject line, and I'll get back to you. I, I I provide service for other people writing books. It's a little pricey, but it, it'll work. You'll have a great book. Good morning, Tim. See you at 2.30. So cool. Come on, look at this. You put CBD oil in your coffee? Eh, every once, I don't do it every day, but I, I do it. What can I do to help you win today? Ken Walls. Charles Coachman, good morning. Oh, wow. See, there you go. And Charles Wilkerson. Good morning from Charlotte. Morning, dude. Hope all is well in Charlotte, North Carolina. I'll be back there in a few days. Good morning, sir. Good morning, Vic. Good morning. Good morning. This is this is so cool. LinkedIn might be because of the number of redirections in the URL. I don't know. I have no idea. I'm not that smart of a guy. I just want to help 29,900 LinkedIn connections get better. That's my total objective. And if LinkedIn wants to be that selfish about it, there's nothing I can do about it. Larry, good morning. Success has many fathers. Failure, none. <laughs> Ken Walls, Q&A show. Yeah, Purdue, Justin Benton, Francine Dressed. Absolutely. Email me your address and I'll mail you. Oh, cool. See, come on. Come on. The Q&A show on Facebook. Okay, cool. Can you and I do a live interview on our homepage of The Hustle? Freedom Fridays is done at 8 p.m. Friday. Send me an invite. We'll talk about it. 
Francine, I have a few connections with LinkedIn, and I know that LinkedIn works with StreamYard. Let me see what I can do. Francine, thank you. Look at me. Thank you so much. Stay on me. Been sending short videos to clients and prospects. Competition is drinking beer and pretending everything is okay. Gotta love it. I concur, Steve. Way to go. Um, here's an endorsement for Justin Benton. I love this. Bruce, I know a LinkedIn influencer. Not sure how much pull they have. I'll DM you with the name. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Wilt was the better individual player, but Russell was the total team player. The 11 rings speak volumes. What is this? What is this? Wilt was the best individual player in the history of basketball, period. He only has two or three rings. Okay. You know, that's part of the ball game. But he got, he has rings. I'm just, in short, like a sale. Yeah, Russell, I mean, he just wasn't as good a player as Wilt, period. Hello, Risa. How are you? Where are you from, Risa? Thanks, Tony Thorpe. It's so cool. Small impact can create good momentum that leads to a much bigger impact. Get out there and run into things. I concur. Listen, if you're trying to make an impact, you have to be out there or you have to be in there broadcasting in some way or another, going live, having a podcast, you know, creating some kind of a live stream. Just go out into the world, whether it's virtually or face to face and make an impact every single morning. I anyone that I interact with, I make them smile every single morning. I don't care who it is. I make them smile. Sometimes they don't want to. I do it anyway. Everyone's haying each other. Come on. When I expect the books for the Operation Care, when can I expect the books for Operation Care Package? Um, soon. Um, uh, Justin, can you please, or Ken, um, I, I need an address. I'm away for the next week. You'll have them as soon as I get home. You'll have them as soon as I get home. We plan on shipping the end of August. Now you'll have them in July. Make sure, to email me, jeffreyakidmer.com. Just put operation care package in the in the um, subject line. I'll make sure I get it to Erica. She'll pack up stuff right away. Grateful to those who reached out to me yesterday. Thank you. Isn't that cool? Ken Walls, you made my day, brother. Thank you for the shout out. Okay, cool. Man, look at all these messages this morning. It's unbelievable. From Rio again. Daniel, hello from Rio. Bon dia. Oh, my God. I will send you some coffee back from St. Louis. Thank you very much. Use voice notes on your phone to capture creative idea flow. Absolutely, Christine. Pat Hazel, after I got divorced, I began sexing myself. And there you go. Um, you know that that uh, after my house, that Zen quote, after my house burned down, I saw the moon more clearly. There, I saw a, a movie in uh, New York City. I think it's called Fire and Ice. It's about animals in the jungle. It's as Zen as possibly can can possibly be, I'm gonna make sure that I take a look at that. Fire and ice. I'll, I'll try my best to uh, resurrect that. It's one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my life and it moved, that's how the movie started out with that Zen quote. I mean, you just knew you were in for it. Angela, love it, it's the best coffee on the planet, I concur. Good morning from Bangalore, Bangalore, Bangalore India. Good morning to you, and thank you for being here from 15,000 miles away. Buongiorno from Portland, Coffee Roasters Capital. It is, it totally is. Shared out, thank you very kindly. Shared out, thank you very kindly. Christopher, Death Wish Coffee, the best. Thanks for introducing it to, it is my pleasure. 
It is my total pleasure. Shared, thank you very kindly. Rich, shared, Pat Hazel. Having an impact on others will have the biggest impact on you. I agree 1,000%. You feel great when you make an impact on other people. I don't, this show doesn't make me feel good. This show makes me feel great every single day. Now, guys, I got to go. I got to go. Have you read the book, Let Me Tell You a Story by Red Auerbach? Brilliant person, almost a GM of the Knicks back in the day. Uh, Red Auerbach was an innovator. Every th and, um, you know, after every game, he lit a big cigar. Um, I hated him when I was a Sixers fan. I admire him now that he's passed for his ability. Great, great ability. David shared, thank you very kindly. Um, I got to go, you guys. I, I apologize. I, I have to go. Um, we'll leave it from Tirana. I'm going to tell you to go to useanyvood.com and get yourself a background like this. And if you don't, <laughs> I want the computer to be at my height. I'll, tomorrow I'm going to tape it down to the table so it doesn't go crazy. And go to use hippo video. Dot com and they give you a seven day free trial go there try it it's it's the future just do what i'm asking you to do just go and uh use any boo boom and hippo video dot com use hippo video dot com boom go um, thank you very much for attending today. I will see you tomorrow. Bring a couple of friends. Cheers. And please, healthy day, successful day, amazing day to you.